What is up guys, it is Tony here and today we are doing a gaming computer build. Today we are doing the affordable AMD build. Last week we did the more expensive version of this build. Uh, except this week we are of course doing a more affordable one at $640. This is extremely cheap. Throw a monitor and a keyboard in there, you're under 800 bucks. It's pretty, pretty affordable. So, we're going to go ahead and get right into the build. So first off we have the processor which of course we're going with just the typical FX 6300 for AMD. This is a great processor for the price, 6 cores of processing power, lots of speed and this will definitely do the job. For the motherboard we're just going to go with a motherboard that supports that processor, supports the graphics card and everything. It's just a simple $70 board that actually supports Crossfire which is of course very useful and just all around supports all of the new technologies you will need. For the RAM, we're just going to go with a simple 8GB kit. You can upgrade it to 16GB down the road. You get 1600MHz of speed. It's nothing too special, no, no type of gaming memory here, but it does the job all around, supports the CPU and all of that. And for the GPU, we're going to go with this really cool new 260X from AMD. This thing is extremely fast, great benchmark numbers, and you can also crossfire it at a price of $150. This is an incredible value. And for the hard drive, we're just going to go with something basic, just a good starter hard drive, one terabyte of space, very fast, 7200 RPMs with 64 megabytes of cache. This is basically not a value or economy hard drive at all. And for the power supply, we're going to go with something a little bit more value oriented. This is a 500 watt bronze um, PSU from EVGA. So you get the good brand, but overall it's not you know super expensive or anything like that, so it's a good value. And then for the case, we're just going to go with the Cooler Master High Air Flow. This is an extremely good case um, for 90 bucks. This is something that you should really invest into because it gives you great airflow. Um, it just overall gives you everything you need in terms of I.O. And it's just great for the price. And there you go. That is the AMD affordable build. Uh, basically, our goal here was just to try to create something that's under $700 just for the components alone. Um, this is a very good value for what you pay. Um, if you're really serious about getting into high-end gaming, this actually could do a really good job because um, the 260X can really handle some really high-end games, some newer games in the market like Battlefield 4. Um, and of course, if you aren't getting the performance you need, you can just add another GPU for just another 150 bucks, and boom, you have a nice crossfire setup and you could probably set up Ifinity and have a lot of fun with the setup. Uh, so overall, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, leave some feedback below. It's always appreciated. If you did enjoy it, leave feedback. But that is pretty much it. I am Tony, and I'll see you guys next time. What is up, guys? It is Tony here, and today we are doing another affordable gaming computer build. Last week, we did the AMD build, and this week, we are doing the NVIDIA one for all those NVIDIA fans out there, because uh, I am one of them, and I know some of you guys have uh, software, you have an NVIDIA shield, and you need something that'll work with all of that stuff. So, basically this build is the same exact build except with an NVIDIA setup. So we're going to go ahead and get right into it. So first off for the...